Random Math Problem number 78. A football team has won uh, 54 out of 75 games played. With 45 games still to go, uh, what percentage of these must be won uh, to give the team a record for the season of 60% games won out of all games played? Okay, so try nyo po munang sagutan bago panoodin ang aking solution. So ito po ang ating mga choices. 45%, 25%, 40%, 18%, and 35%. Okay, so sagutan na natin ang ating problem. So ang sabi, a football team has won 54 out of 75. So yun yung uh, percentage nila, yung current na percentage nila, 54 out of 75. Since percentage ito, ibig sabihin, i-over lang natin ito. So currently, ang percentage nila ay 54 out of 75. Okay? So, yan ang percentage nila sa ngayon. 54 out of 75. And then, meron, meron pang natitirang 45 games. With 45 games still to go, what percentage of this must be won to give the team a record for the season? So, to give a team a record for the season of 60 games. 60 games daw dapat yung kakalabasan. Out of all, uh, 60% games won, out of all games played. So, ibig sabihin, may 75 pa tayong natitira. Oh, okay, sorry, may 45 games pa. With 45 games still to go, what percentage of this must be won? So, ibig sabihin, mag a tayo dito sa currently na 54 out of 75. So, ito yung denominator. Ito yung total. Okay? So, ito yung total na total na games. So, meron pa daw tayong 45. So, ibig sabihin, mag a tayo ng 45 dito sa denominator na total. So tapos, ang question, ilan daw yung kailangan nilang ipanalo? So mag a tayo dito ng hindi natin alam. So ilalagay natin yun yung unknown. So ilalagay natin yung X. So ito yung X, ito yung kailangan manalo out of the remaining 45 games para magkaroon daw sila ng record na 60%. Okay? So pag sinabing 60%, uh, percent means percent means per 100 or over 100. So, imbis na 60% ang ilagay natin, gawin na natin in fraction. So, that is 60 over 100. Okay? So, 60%, so that is the same as 60 over 100. So, isolve lang natin itong value ng, itong value ng x. And then, after finding the value of x, kukunin pa natin dyan yung with 45 games is still to go, what percentage of this percentage netong 45? Okay? So first kailangan isolve muna natin tong x then up, after getting the value of x, i-divide natin sa 45 para makuha natin yung percentage noon. Percentage of this yung 45 games yung tinutukoy doon. Okay, so sagutan na natin ito. So just copy the numerator 54 plus x. And then the denominator, so just simplify this 75 plus 45. Th this is equal to 120. So, 120, 7, 5 plus 5, so that is 10, carry 1, so 8 plus 4, okay. 120 equals, reduce this to lowest term, I divide natin parehas ito by, divide natin by 20, okay? So, divisible parehas by 20, 60 divided by 20, that is 3, 100 divided by 20 is 5. And then next, I i-cross multiply na natin, okay? So, cross multiply na natin ito. So, cross multiply lang natin, so 5, times 54 plus x is equal to 3 times 120. Okay? So, solve for x lang tayo. So, distribute muna natin itong 5. So, 5 times 54. So, scratch tayo dito. 54 times 5. We have 5 times 4. We have 20. 5 times 5 is 25 plus 2, 27. So, we have 270 plus 5 times x. Now, that is equal to 5x is equal to 3 times 120. Kung 3 times 12, that is 36. So, may 0. So, we have 360. Then, solve for x. So, subtract muna tayo ng 270 to both sides. Subtract 270 to both sides para makancel out ito. So, we have 5x equal to 360 minus 270. So, 0 minus 0 yan. 0 lang. Bring down. So, magiging itong 16 minus 7. So, we have 9. Ito, magiging 2 na lang ito. 2 minus 2, 0 na lang. So, last step, divide both sides by 5. Okay. So when we divide both sides by 5, the value of x is equal to 90 divided by 5. So scratch tayo, 90 divided by 5, we have 1 times 5, we have 5 subtract. So 9 minus 5, 4, bring down 0, 40 divided by 5, we have 8. 8 times 5, 40, okay, wala nang remainder. 
Okay, so therefore, the value of x is 18. So ang question, hindi pa natatapos dito sa 18, kukunin pa natin yung percentage daw no out of 45. With 45 games still to go, what percentage of this must be want to give uh, to give the team a record of 60%? So i-over lang natin ito sa 45 games. So 18 over 45. So i-lowest term lang natin. Pwedeng... Bago kayong mag-divide, i-lowest term muna para mas madali. So, divisible kasi pareha sa 9. Okay, so divide natin pareha sa 9 para mas madali tayong uh, makapag uh, may convert sa percent. 18 divided by 9, we have 2. And then 45 divided by 9, that is equal to 45. 45 divided by 9, that is equal to equal to 5. So, 2 over 5. So, madali na siyang i-convert sa percent. 2 over 5. So, pwedeng i-divide nyo na lang ito sa... Pwedeng i-divide na lang ito. So, 2 divided by 5. Pero meron pang isang technique na mas madali. So, pag 2 divided by 5, dagdag lang tayo na isang 0. Itapat yung decimal dito. So, 20 divided by 5, we have 4. 4 times 5, we have 20. So, wala ng remainder. So, therefore, we have 0.4. So, 0.4, that is equal to... Convert natin sa percent. Move lang natin ng decimal. So, we have 40... 40%. Okay? Or shortcut, gawin natin itong 100. Paano ba maging 2 over 5? Paano, kailangan, ang percent means uh, divided by 100. So, gawing 100 ang denominator by multiplying by 20. Multiply pareha sa 20 para maging over 100. 2 times 20, we have 40. 5 times 20, we have 100. So, therefore, 40 over 100, that is equal to 40%. Okay? So, pwede nating i-divide yung 2 over 5. Pwede namang i-multiply sa 20 para makuha natin yung over 100 na 40%. The correct answer is letter C. Okay? So, that's it. So, I hope nagustuhan yung explanation ko para sa problem na ito. Thank you for watching and kita-kita tayo sa mga susunod pang mga random math problem. Kung may math question po kayo ay comment nyo lang po dito sa aking channel. Pwede rin sa aking FB group or i-DM nyo ako sa aking messenger na RJ Ensenyado. Bye-bye and God bless.